in chapter 16 of the adventures of Huckleberry Finn, Jim looks forward to being free when he finally gets to Caro. Huck feels guilty about helping Jim escape. Miss Watson never did anything to harm Huck. Jim talks about earning money to buy his family's freedom or having abolitionists kidnap them. Huck gets upset and decides that he's going to turn Jim in when he gets ashore. When Huck goes to check to see if they've reached Caro, Jim says that Huck is his only friend. He's the only one he knows that keeps his promises. These statements make Huck confused about how to act. Huck comes across men in a boat who were looking for escaped slaves. When asked about the raft, Huck makes up a story that his parents have smallpox. The men are scared by this, and they give Huck money and leave. Jim thanks Huck profusely, as he heard what Huck told the men. They look for Caro, but they don't see it. And later, Huck discovers that they have missed it completely. Their canoe is lost, and a steamboat shows up and crushes their raft, destroying it. Huck and Jim jump into the river to avoid harm, and they are separated. Huck ends up on the shore, surrounded by a pack of dogs. In this chapter, Huck faces a severe moral dilemma. Jim has many fine qualities, but Huck's been brought up to believe that slavery is what's right. There seems to be no right answer for Huck. An opportunity presents itself for Huck to turn Jim in. Instead, Huck lies in order to save his friend. Huck's own sense of justice seems to win over the rules he was raised by. Ironically, the town they need to get to to reach Jim's freedom is Cairo, which is spelled like Cairo. In the Bible, the Jews are enslaved to the Egyptians, whose capital city is Cairo. The Jews experienced miracles that enabled them to escape their slavery, led by the iconic biblical figure, Moses. One miracle was Moses' parting of the Red Sea, which is what allowed the Jews to actually leave Cairo. For Jim, Cairo represents the opposite. Reaching Cairo and getting up the Ohio River will mean that Jim is free. Huck plays the role of Moses. He's trying to part the seas to lead his good friend to freedom.